All right, unboxing of a waterproof tape measure. I won't try to pronounce that. It won't go well for me. So, let's get to it. It's kind of a cool box, as far as boxes go. That's neat. That is a beastie retraction. Let's see how long that lasts. So, kind of half stainless, half plastic. Uh, reviews say that this snaps. Got a feeling it's probably the plastic part that snaps, though. Well, that's fully locked. And that doesn't take much. Really doesn't take much to move that on lock. Hmm. Well, straight away, the lock's not great. Um, there's no other kind of push down buttons that you can use to stop that happening. Okay, well, if you're not too bothered about that, it's all good. So, the, yeah, this is waterproof um, stainless steel parts. This, I don't know what this is. I don't know if this is thin tin. There's a strange kind of texture going on here. I don't know what that's made of. It's obviously some kind of laminate over metal. Hopefully this doesn't rust, as they say. Um, I don't know if it's the parts inside that won't rust or it's the tape. But as you know, if you mess with tape measures, you just have to breathe on this and it'll be rusted the next day. Um, but I'll add to this as far as comments go, after a few weeks of use, um, to see how I get on with it. Five meters by 19. For a five meter tape measure, 19 mil seems to be the standard on width. So when they're saying 19 mil, they mean the width of this, which determines how long it will stand out without collapsing. Um, but you know, it is what it is. looks pretty good. Um, shame about the break though. That's quite a poor break. But for me personally, I'm not too fussed about the break. I just don't want it rusting. That's the main reason for having this. Um, I, I work with cement and dust a lot and it would be nice to literally wash this under the tap to get rid of all that dust and not having that rust. So yeah, that's enough of that, I think.